what's up guys welcome back with another video after a long time another update rolled out for redmi 7 and redmi y3 from havoc os and this is official of course and if you are using the older one like 4.10 or 4.11 then you guys can easily update this uh, update this version without losing any data so let's get started and i'll review just make a short review i don't want to waste your time so let's get started first of all let me show you from the settings and uh, what is updated and the user interface is totally changed just like the icons and some uh, new features are integrated not features actually uh, one kind of features just like uh, the wallpaper colors that means uh, according to your wallpaper colors the whole system will be changed that means the whole system color will be changed now here you guys can see the icon pack and the icon packs are just like the wallpaper color so uh, it all it automatically detects the wallpaper color and it will uh, be like that so here is the about section and you can see the android version 11 and have okay version 4.12 and thanks to the builder and very latest very latest security update which is december 5 so the, this month and default kernel you guys will get 4.9.282 from havoc s plus that means their own kernel and which is also capable and i found some smoothness uh compared to the earlier version and i found one just a minor problem and i will discuss about this also no problem here is the system you guys already know about that i don't want to waste time so after that google and digital well-being accessibility you guys already know about that and of course as it is android 11 so we have all the features like app locker smart lock and face unlock and fingerprint all the features are available and also you guys can uh, hide applications and i will show it later so after that we have privacy section and here is the sound you guys can see as usual the regular customizations are available and here is the display settings and in display settings adaptive brightness and wallpaper this is the new features they actually just included here you guys can see wallpaper based theming that means if you enable this feature then when you apply any uh, any wallpaper then it will work just like system engine so here is the blur windows if you want to enable blur for various system then just enable this feature no problem and night light everything is working styles and wallpaper live display if you have idea then you guys can uh, do color calibration then use no problem and after that here you guys can see double tap which is working fine and skin server smallest to it and refresh rate which is used this for this device because by default you have only 60 hertz so no issues and screen at the same you guys can see attention is cool feature you guys can use this one and after that we have the configuration center the final thing the status bar cloak logo brightness control as usual the regular customizations all the regular customizations are available in that build nothing new here but everything is just working pretty much fine without any issue you guys can use of course if you guys want to use mdn display also you guys can use that but i don't recommend it will drain your battery and here is the gesture button and gesture of swipe three finger screenshot working if you want to take partial screenshot that also working and notifications edge lightning you guys can see here is the edge lighting option so when notification will come your edge will lighting so this is a cool feature and blink for incoming call disable you guys can enable the flashlight no problem and after that we have battery saving options screen media miscellaneous of course we have the gaming mode you guys can use and we have the screenshot type you guys can select full or partial no issues and here is the about section if you want then you guys can read and after that we have the network section as usual we have the all features like 4G calling and preferred network options so many options are there and Wi-Fi calling carrier video calling all those things are available and all the things are really cool and working now let's talk about some basic things uh, does it pass the safety net or not and let me just run the test and here you can see by default safety net is passed and I already installed the magic and so you guys can easily use uh, any banking application without any problem and you guys can use also ANX camera in that room no problem and you guys also can use any kind of Gcam no issues 
and after that let me show you the cpu throttling and here is the 85 percent which is just very good for redmi 7 i guess and after that we have the uh, geekbench score and let me show you that and which is pretty much decent for android 11 no problem and here is that 262 and 1049 very decent no issues and i charge it no charging issue you guys will get first charging no problem it will do your charge uh, do the charge perfect in time so no problem you guys can use that one and smoothness let's talk about that and i found smoothness actually just increased in that build they actually just polished it really cool now let's talk about the problem I found here. Only one problem, and which is uh, the phone application, which just uh, did lag. This kind of I found it, but now it fixed. Here you can see. Previously I found there is a problem, but now it fixed. So my recommendation will be just installing the ROM. After installing, then just change the wallpaper and just give you give your device a reboot then it will be fixed automatically now no issues so the issue was that one also, also so everything got fixed you guys can easily use right now so no bugs not a single one now let me show you how can you guys hide the applications so go to home screen sorry for that an app drawer and here you guys will get the hidden apps so uh, if your choice you know, according to your choice you guys can just hide your application just click on the i button it, your application will be hidden so no problem with that and here is the gesture some customizations are there and if you double tap your skin will be locked and if you change wallpaper according to your wallpaper you guys will get uh, the color here the notification panel or control center whatever you say you guys will get change here and dark mode or spot everything is just working pretty much fine and location and you guys will get great location perfect location no problem using google application and i'm using here the uh, gfs build i will drop the both link in description you guys can download gfs build or vanilla build and let's talk about battery battery performance i found which is cool this is really cool battery no issues if you are a daily rom user then this is a perfect rom for you and the gaming section you guys will be able to see after uh, at the end of this video i already added so watch the gameplay so you guys can also play game no problem and this smoothness is mind blowing just mind blowing you guys can easily use no problem and next i will just want to review cr droid or uh, ROS. so stay connected thank you for watching